Well, we got Gemini's Nano Banana at a Notebook LM, but uh, this is not like what you're thinking because even though Gemini Nano Banana is known for creating and editing a picture, this model is actually not used to create a custom picture in Notebook LM. In fact, it is actually used to generate a video. So do you remember the video overview feature in Notebook LM, which basically allow you to create video based on documents or links that you just provided into your notebook. But this time around, a Notebook LM is utilizing Nano Banana to create a different styles for the video. Because after all, these videos are actually really just a presentation and they're just being formed by some static pictures and even though there's nothing wrong with that this is not the same with you know creating videos using the video models this is basically for creating some sort of static picture or presentation slide but at this time around it is going to be using the gemini nano banana model and I would say this is pretty good because now we are not stuck with just one particular style. We can select different styles like there is the anime style, there is also the whiteboard style, there is also watercolor, uh, paper crop, and many others. Uh, this is one example that I created or AI created using Notebook LM and this is the one with uh, paper craft style and this is the classic uh, video overview style in Notebook LM. As you can see, they look different because one is using a picture that was created by, by Gemini's Nana Banana. So I would say it looks more interesting. And if you want to present this in a classroom or an office, it's going to attract attention than this basic presentation. So I'm going to show you how you can actually generate videos and utilizing Nano Banana to select the style for your video. So what you need to do is you have to navigate to notebooklm.google.com and yes, you have to use the web version because I've checked the mobile version of notebooklm. There is no option to create a video, at least right now. Now after that, you can open your notebook or perhaps you can create a new one. But in this case, I'll just open the notebook that I just created before. So after that, you can click this pencil icon on video overview and then select the format whether it is explainer or a brief video and you can choose the language and after that of course this is the most important element you can select the style for the video there is auto select it is going to adjust the option based on the content of your video there is the classic style which is the previous version of video overview there is also whiteboard watercolor retro painting, heritage, uh, paper craft, and anime. I think there's going to be some other styles in the future, but right now, these are the options that we have. Now, let me just select maybe anime style, and I'm going to click generate. So you have to wait for several minutes because it might take quite a while to create a video. But after that, you can watch the video and you can even download the content to your computer. So I'll just skip over and show you the final result. Okay, so the video is ready. I'm going to open it. And I guess I'm going to play the first maybe 10 or 20, uh, 20 seconds of this video. And let me, let me know what you thought about uh, this video. I'm going to All play right, it. right, let's talk electricity. What are volts, amps, and watts anyway? Let's break it down. I mean, electricity is totally invisible. So how in the world do we actually measure it? You know, the easiest way to picture it is to think about water flowing through a pipe. So first up is current, measured in amps. That's simply how Okay, so I would say that's definitely more interesting than the basic presentation that was offered in the previous version of NotWellM. So that's always a nice improvement, but I'm hoping that in the future we can also specify the style that we want to have on the video. Right now, we can only select some presets, but I'm hoping that we can actually select or use our own prompt for the style of the video but that's something that we have to wait and see but anyway that's how you can create videos utilizing the gemini's nano banana or gemini 2.5 plus image in notebook lm thank you so much for watching and i'll see you on my next video i wish you a great day ahead